No, we're security guards. I'm not gonna be your stupid announcer. You could get in trouble for this. Fine, I'll be my own announcer again. I don't need you. I'm, I'm, I'm probably better off this way. Welcome to The Gate Show from Sunshine Studios. Today, Fred Willard, food delivery mistakes, Len Glum, Hollywood's funniest asthma sufferer, and now a man who will never date a girl with a dragon tattoo, Fred Stoller! All right, well, oh, you know what I did this weekend, um, Walt? Martin, I joined the gym. Uh, they told me not to work out in the window, it'll hurt business. Because I'm skinny and it's... I'm new though, I'm new. All right, let's go to the cleavage cam. The cleavage cam. Who do we have? Oh, these look like some models driving in. That could be Halle Berry. And that's someone from Sex and the City 2. Menopause can be cruel. Who the hell were you? Oh, I got a great idea to get the guests in a better mood, okay? Before the interview, we put them in a green room and we get them all liquored up so they get loose. How are we gonna do that? I got us one, bro. <laughs> Wait, you got us a green room? Sure did. Yeah. If you did, if you did, that's a good thing. Finally, good idea. But it was was mine, though. Uh, I don't, don't you, didn't I come up with that one? Hi, I'm Fred Willard. I'm here to do the talk show. They said to come in gate 33. Ladies and gentlemen, Fred Willard! Hey, you know what we should do before the interview? Why don't I take Fred into the green room, get him loosened up, huh? Right. right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, if you want to come with me. Oh, okay. Yeah. You got a valet parked for the car? Oh, oh yeah, valet, sure. Whatever okay. you want. Whatever I you didn't want. want to be casual. I brought a suit there. Uh, uh, be careful, it's got one of those electronic keys. Oh yeah, that'll be fine. The green room, that was the best idea I ever had. Fred Willard will be tenfold so much better interview. Once he's in the green room, it'll be looser and crazier, crazier stories. This way, Fred, here's the green room. Oh. Oh. Be careful with that car. I had some ideas of different ways to go. I just got some uh, porno magazines and a beer to get you started, huh? Get you a little loose. <laughs> Enjoy, oh, well, get loose. <laughs> well, I, I'm kind of loose already. Uh, I just want to see a segment producer right, or something. We'll work on that. Now, uh, I believe we have something else for you. Uh, Brenda, let's get this gentleman loose. Welcome to the parking lot, the parking lot of love. Welcome to the green room. Are you on the show? Back it up. Back you want to back it up, back it up. I just did a film with Morgan Freeman. I don't know if I should talk about it because it's not out for a couple of months. Oh, uh, you'll be a free man soon enough. Uh -huh. What time does the show start? Oh, my allergies are terrible. Yeah, huh? now that's what I call loose. I can make all your wishes come true. All my wishes? All of them. Well, let me think. Oh, I've got one. Yeah. Hey, is that Charlie Sheen? Oh, I heard he's here today. Thank you. You would be good on the show. Keep the car. Now Oscar will present his segment, Celebrities at the Commissary. Where is he? He's relaxing, getting loose in the green room. In the green room. Back it up, back it up, back it up. What's great about me is I'm young. I'm I'm the voice and the face of youth. I'm the youngest talk show host, except for Conan, Jimmy Kimmel, Jimmy Fallon. Yeah. <clears throat> You're younger than Letterman, though. Letterman yeah. and Letterman. I don't know about Leno, I think you might be the same age. No. Well, he has like sort of young face, like a baby face. Your face look, doesn't look What's like a baby. What's good about talk shows is we can do this forever. Right, right, No right. one's kicking me out of my booth. I'm a franchise. That's right. Back it up, 